Howdy y'all, Joe Hills here recording as I was doing Nashville, Tennessee, and today on the Hermitcraft server I woke up and I logged in and look what I discovered, I better not fall off there, it's a crazy big bridge, an unacceptably thin, unacceptably unstructured, unacceptably unlit, unacceptably in my face when I log in bridge, you know, I thought oh I'm gonna log in, I'm gonna look at these pretty lights I put in here between episodes, yeah they're down there, they look pretty. Uh-oh, where's my sword? I'm gonna need my sword later to attack whoever put this bridge up. No, probably not. Peaceful, peaceful thoughts. Not gonna start any feuds. Not gonna make any trouble. Uh, hey, that's a nice little spruce farm. I kind of do want to cut that down and have some spruce, though. So, let's see. We got some weird blocks over here. Thank you for digging a pit, whoever did that. Okay, so it looks like this crazy bridge seems to go to the people house over here. And I'm not sure why we have a people house on the server. I figured it was like a British thing. Let's actually... Is there a way to get into here? I've never actually gone up here before. No. So we have some sort of weird people house building. And I have no extra cobble. So if breaking this causes a problem, I can't easily fix it. Okay, so there's people in there. Wow! Apparently I should be turning all my rotten flesh into whatever those things are. They're shiny. Hey, you guys, what are you doing over there? Wheat for diamonds? Spider webs for diamonds? Oh my goodness! I had no idea this place even existed. Well, I mean, I knew it existed, but I had no idea that there was so much wealth to be had inside of it. Okay, so that explains one half of this. The bridge is clearly here as a, like a subway stop to serve these folks. But then the next question is, where does it go? Let me go ahead and chug this potion of swiftness. So that I can swiftly ascertain its true course. I mean, I know that it generally goes this way. Instead of following a beautiful curve and slope, as would be more aesthetically pleasing. And then there's my house. Looking good as always, my house. I do like this because I could take, like, you know, awesome scenic shots of my house better. From a cool angle. You can see my little uh, stable in there. You can see Woe Hills. Howdy, Woe Hills! Whoa, you're how far away and high up and unsupported. That bridge doesn't look safe. It's an eyesore. Tear it down. I know, at Woe Hills, I know. Okay, so we're going to continue on this way, past our beautiful crops, past our beautiful lights in the ground, and not fall off the end there. So where where's this actually leading us? It seems to take us to the farming plateau, but not for any discernible purpose, like obviously or intuitively. Does it go down and start following the ground here? No. It just ends. Why does it just end? Okay, so hopefully this won't, you know, cause his, uh, his carts to accidentally bounce back that way the entire length of the track. You know, that would be terrible. Oh, you know what's... This, these are not, these are not powered rails. How is that supposed to work? Maybe he's sending people from that side over to this side. Wow, it's a good thing that I got those feather fallen boots. Man, health regenerates fast when you've eaten a bunch of steak recently, too. That's nice. I gotta figure out what I want to do with all this, though. Like, I've got a lot of pieces of my house that are just kind of remnants of the beginning of the server, like this little farm here. I think I should probably dig this out. I've got this field of cactus here, which I kind of like, but I feel like I need to sparsify it a little bit. Like, let's just chop up some of these cacti and give them a little bit more breathing room, because this is like first day getting the server going stuff. Okay, so this looks a little bit less dense than it used to. These cacti are a little bit less, uh, cac close. I don't know, something. There's, there's something there. Let's go ahead and take care of all this dirt, too, while we're at it. Dang it, this stake is just an inefficient implement for digging. You know, steak might be able to conquer my hunger very quickly, very rapidly, but it does not conquer the remains of a farm very well at all. Dang it, steak. I'm going to have to include that in my next commercial in the interest of, you know, honesty. Okay, so this is yellow, and we've got a little bit of yellow stained clay here we can use to either, yeah, kind of pen this in a little bit, kind of make this not be quite so drifty. Dang it, I was hoping to have like source blocks all the way over. The whole point of this is that we're supposed to be cleaning this up and instead we're making a bigger mess. Hey yellow blocks, what you doing? You busy? 
cool, no? Awesome. Awesome. We're just cleaning up everything. It's clean up day on the server. There we go. We have cleaned up this little uh, historic farm here. And it's little sign. Joe Hill's dang it caps lock farm. Well, I think that we can take you down as well. Because this is no longer the location of that farm. There is no farm here. Just a little fishing pit. Although I've never fished in it. Now that I've cleaned up my little farm over there, my little antique farming spot, I figured I'd follow this modern rail line to see what these fellas are up to. Oh, you need raw pork? I don't have any of that. Wow, of course, both of them want raw pork. This guy wants more rotten flesh than I have. What about you, sir? You are actually somebody who I can trade with. Okay, so after all these years, or episodes, or whatever, playing on the server, I finally understand what this thing is for. And it looks like it's going to go away. Probably should have been taking advantage of this the whole time. Oh, did Asuma build a new temporary bridge? Is this seriously going to be the bridge that he... It did, I'm just living in a world where everybody's putting in terrible bridges everywhere. And my beautiful work is destroyed. I, I can come to peace with this. I can... And I will. Hey, there's a sail. Let's go check that out. Oh, I also like this fountain. Ooh, the glass on here is really good, too. I wonder what that is. Like, I mean, I know it's a fountain, but, like, I wonder if it's for something in particular. One diamond is two stacks. Wasn't it already one diamond for two stacks? You know, I kind of think I'm going to put in a diamond and take one dark oak and... One jungle wood. Just so I've got a little bit more variety in my builds. Because, like, it's hard to build stuff when you're always using the same things. I mean, you know, if all you did was make stuff out of bricks, that would be, uh... I don't know, you'd end up with this thing. I don't even know what this is. Probably some sort of auto smelter. But, you know, if you only built things out of cobble, you'd end up with bridges that all look like this. Is that a chicken in a boat? Okay, whatever. Terrible bridges are the theme of the episode. Not because I wanted them to be. Because terrible bridges cannot be escaped. Terrible bridges exist everywhere. Terrible bridges are like baby spiders crawling and wriggling inside your hair. Look at this bridge, it's really creeping me out. Look at this bridge, it makes me want to scream and shout. Look at this bridge, but I don't know how. I'm going to go fast enough to go where I should go on this bridge. Whoa. What if, uh, doesn't this bridge, like, need those, uh, those special glowy, glowy, um, fastness boosters in order to move people far enough? Like, I don't know if you can push things very far without those speed boost things. Hey, at No Hills. How's it going? Pretty good, I guess. You get anything cool for me at the store? Actually, yeah, there was a sale. So I was going to take some of this, uh, this dark wood here and see how it incorporates into your, uh, mystique slash motif we got going on here. Like, I feel like having these kind of dividers kind of unites the design of your pen with that of at Woe Hills, who's busy looking out the window, and with the uh, rest of the house. Whoops. So, like, by taking this... Dang it, I really need to start keeping the right tools in my hot bar. You know, I've only been doing this for four years. Like, it's it's borderline. In a, whoa, don't kick me in the face, man. But we gotta run an errand. It's, it's really important. Uh, what kind, what kind of errand you got in mind at No Hills? We gotta pay the ferryman. Remember I said I owe the ferryman, like, a bunch of diamonds? Because of the two-way trip across the... The ferry on the river sticks. Yeah, I do remember that. That sounded pretty terrifying, so I kind of brushed it off. And ho oh, oh, you got to do it, man. We got to go get these diamonds t to the ferryman right away. Okay, man, you don't got to get up all in my face. Okay, cool. Cool, let's go get the diamonds. I guess you can come in the house to get them with me, because, like, the house is horse-friendly enough. Was there always just dirt on the ceiling? Wait. I don't want to break that. That might be really... That maybe that, that might be load-bearing dirt. Okay. So let's go ahead and... So we're going to get the diamonds for the ferryman. 
Yeah, I need a ten. You should bring some emeralds to tip him. Uh, oh, okay, okay. So we'll bring some emeralds and some 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 diamonds for the ferryman. Uh, do you know where on the server the ferryman lives? Because that would be you know helpful information to have if I'm gonna head in his general direction. Oh my gosh, you built this terrible bridge. I'm glad I can't see it from my room. Yeah, I know how you feel. Except I can see it from my room, so I actually envy you entirely. I have no idea what it's like to not see that bridge. But, um, where are we going? Yeah, the ferryman lives over in the other residential district. Oh, oh okay, well, that would be good to know before I ran all the way to the commercial district, but, but thank you. Thank you for your timely and apt instructions. Well, I think we can probably go this way, and hopefully not to run into too much trouble on the way. I believe that this connects to the other residential district. It's pretty roundabout, but you know what? So are those traffic circles in Britain, so I think we'll be okay. Wow, that's a really cool house. Um, I'm a big fan of a lot of the buildings and stuff that people make on the server here. But, like, that one's a pretty cool one. Let's go ahead and just hop up here. Yeah, so the ferryman's name is Tango Tech, and he says I owe him the diamonds. And if I don't bring them, he's going to give me another trip on the ferry. Well, well, that would sound like it'd be, you know, an extra expense for him, you know, to give you three trips on the ferry for free, but... Yeah, but... Whoa, that's a creeper, man. Just keep going. Keep... Oh, no, another creeper. Okay, well, man, this seems like a really unsafe part of the server to, uh, you know, stop and talk to Wells Knight about his mission on. But let's see. Let's go ahead and just kind of shoot down any opposition we immediately see. Dang it, a single skeleton. What are you doing over there? Oh, that's right. You're burning to death. Ah, not a single skeleton at all. You are two skeletons. Whoa, you're running, you're side strafing. Whoa, zombie. Did he hit the zombie with his first shot? That is miraculous. Now the zombie's after us because we hit him too. Okay, okay. So this is a really exposed area. It's the middle of the night. Is this Tango Tech's house? I think this is. So we're just going to go ahead here. And put this box in with the ten diamonds, five emeralds. Dang it, that's not how signs work. Well, it is. It is how signs work. Whatever. For the ferryman tango, night time can't spell fast. Done. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. This almost got really stupid real quickly. Instead, it's just moderately stupid at a rapid pace. Thank, thank you, Wells Knight. You are my hero. Okay, so I'd like to point at the part where I didn't look at the Enderman as a, a triumph for all well-meaning people. So now, as long as I don't accidentally shoot my horse, which I didn't, because I'm good at this game occasionally in certain ways, along certain axes. At least this bridge has some grass, although that might actually be the entire purpose of the bridge. It might be to spread grass. What do we even have a green district for? What's in the green district? Okay, these trees are not... Okay, that's a spider. Oh, is this the farms? Oh, well, but this wasn't supposed to be farms. It was supposed to be... Oh, that's water. Don't want to go in there. Something else originally. Man... People just keep building stuff all over the server. It's kind of fun. I, I like that part of being on a server with people. Don't like the terrible bridges. I do like the Finding Nemo. That That's cool. How is that multicolored? Is that a multicolored... Oh, that's actual glass. I was thinking that was the beam of one of them projector magic things. Is that a beam of a projector magic thing? Okay, so, well, whatever. This is not a bridge. What is this? XB claims here. Oh, okay. Well, that's a nice little flowery meadow, too. Okay, where were we? We were, we were taking care of little things on the server. We were cleaning up our mess. We were paying off our debts. We were complaining about all the terrible bridges. And we were going to go home if I can ever find my way. Dang it. Okay, so 
That little flower meadow is so cute, though. Look at the look at the little flowers, though. They're so it's like they made clay flowers in there. That's adorable. I like it. Okay, can't can't find my way home. So there's another one of those fancy beam magics. Hey, this is a a, a not a cattle a a wool a sheep. That's right. In order to make um art frames on the server, you need to have uh you need to have wool. So let me go back here. Is there any excess wool in any of these chests? Or even shears? If there are shears in the chest, then I can get my own wool. No. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Ta-da. Okay. So now I can take these shears and then go shear some sheep and then make some fancy paintings. You're not sheep. Dang it, cattle. Woo! Sheep time. Gonna shear the sheep and get their wool for my designs. Okay. Great. So now we can just be a good neighbor and go put these shears back where we found them. After jumping over a bunch of animals and through a bunch of animals, you know, as is our way. Where are we going? Here we are going. Boom. Shears returned. And then I think I know how to get home from here. No, wait. No, I have no idea. Wait, maybe I do know how to get home from here. I just can't get through these trees to do it. Dang it. Whoever planted these trees, that was not a good place to put a bunch of trees. You're literally blocking my way home. Dang it. Okay, okay. So we're going to go... Yeah, because that right there is Wells Knight's Cactus Farm. So, once again, another bridge. This one's at least too wide. And there's, like, some sort of castle. Okay. Here we go. We're almost home. We're free to roam uh, across the plateau. Whoa, what kind of farm is this? Is this a, is this a, a, oh, this is a vine farm. This is so cool. There's no sign who made it. There's no vine sign. Whose design? Ah, oh, you guys need to share this stuff publicly. And I need to not trample your crops with my horse's hooves. So, you know what, we'll call it even. Let's get out of here before uh, I accidentally break somebody else's stuff. Okay, at No Hills, now that we've paid off your debt to the ferryman and we've added a little bit of extra lumber, I'm thinking that you should be set for a little while. Are you pretty happy? My heart knows nothing but contentment. My every waking moment is a living joy. Wonderful, mine too. Great, I'm glad we have so much in common. Okay. So this is this is looking pretty all right. I'm sure we'll end up doing more work on it. I'm kind of wondering what I should do with this floor. Well, just to close out the episode, I've opened up this little bit a little bit here. Dang it, that's a poor way to say it. I've opened up this open space here. I've spaced it out, man. And I think it's going to be a little bit more fluid kind of riding the horses in and around here once I can actually ride them in and around here. See, so we've got this way to fly up here. Or if we're coming down, it's not quite as difficult to get the horses into the pens. And then, you know, I've still got my ability to go out this way. Probably clean that up later. But you know what? You can't clean up everything in one episode. you got to leave something for the next time. We cleaned up a farm. We condemned a lot of bridges. I wish we had condemned them in the way that we were going to blow them up later. I should have condemned the bridges for real. Okay, well, last time my creeper search went very poorly and resulted in the death of a horse. So I gotta figure out, I heard there's a creeper farm on the server. Let's go dig that up in another episode, maybe. Then get a bunch of TNT, then condemn the bridges properly. Okay, well that sounds like a good plan to me. Until next time, y'all, this is Joe Hills from Nashville, Tennessee. Keep adventuring.